Hello, guys. In this lesson, we're going to talk about understanding your commerce account. Let's get started. Facebook Business Suite has integrated Commerce Manager in one of its menus. This allows you to manage your Facebook shop using Business Suite. Commerce Manager includes a set of tools that can help you access your Facebook shop's catalog, view a live shop, create ads for your products, and view your Facebook shop's insights. Now go to your Facebook Business Suite and look for the Commerce menu. When you access the Commerce menu using Business Suite, you will be redirected to the Commerce Manager where you can view the assets for every business account that you have. You can find the shops associated with your Facebook account. And below, you can find the catalogs that you have created for each of your Facebook shops. Choose your business account and look for the Facebook shop that you want to access. The Commerce Overview allows you to learn recommendations such as increasing your sales on your Facebook shop using the checkout option on Facebook or Instagram. In-app checkouts can offer customers a fast and secure checkout, which helps you drive more sales for your Facebook and Instagram shops. The Announcements section shows the recent upcoming changes to Commerce Manager. After you have created your Facebook shop on your business page, the announcement that your Commerce account has been approved will be shown here. This approval is necessary for adding items to your Facebook shop and it will allow your page to have a Facebook shop tab where people can directly check out all your products. If there are issues with your Facebook shop's items, you can review the issues here. Take note of the issues and make sure not to repeat the same things again. You can delete the recent products and upload it again with newer information that will not cause issues regarding your products. You can also view the opportunities that can help you grow your business. You can view recommendations such as filling your catalog faster by adding items in bulk. You can even use the manual form, create a data feed, or even connect to your website so that you can add multiple items. It is recommended that you use dynamic ads so that you can reach more customers. You can promote your shop and products using ads. To start using ads, you must have at least four items in your catalog. If you've added items to your inventory, you can start creating ads. This allows you to target audiences to be redirected to your Facebook shop and purchase your products. This is for the traffic ads. If you want to use dynamic ads, your catalog must have 20 products uploaded on your Facebook shop. That way, more people will see the products in your shop, and you must set up a Facebook pixel if you want to use dynamic ads. This allows you to show items to people who have expressed interest in the items in your Facebook shop and Instagram accounts as well. When you sell your products on Facebook and Instagram, it's better to use Commerce Manager to manage the items that you have uploaded on your shop. Also, if your Facebook business page has a checkout feature enabled, Commerce Manager will help you view payouts so that you can manage your finances, fulfill orders, and process returns. If your Facebook or Instagram ads are underperforming, we have a marketing app that can help you squeeze out more sales, improve conversions, with one simple change. It's called AdResponse. AdResponse will help you get positive ROI from campaigns that then make money earlier, get more engagement and likes from interested visitors, drive more traffic to your landing pages for more dollar spending. AdResponse is the easiest organic sales boost you'll get on your ads. Step 1 is to connect to your pages. Step 2 is to unleash it and AdResponse automatically monitors your comment. Then finally reap it as you watch your trust and traffic build up. Try AdResponse now. Go to adresponse.in. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. I hope you find this video helpful. Thank you for watching and I'll see you on the next video.